You're watching Row Weather Man. This is your tropical update. Block has been downgraded to a tropical depression by the National Hurricane Center. And if you zoom in, you can see that we have the center right here. And this thing is very disorganized with all of the major convection and cloud tops to the right of the center with virtually nothing on the left. And that phenomenon repeats itself on radar as well where you can see most of the convection is to the east of the center. And there are a few showers to the west, but generally speaking, this is a very open and exposed low pressure system. And a lot of dry air is getting in there, a lot of wind shear. So as far as the future of this system, by tomorrow evening, it's expected to be down to just a remnant low and lose its tropical characteristics. And then by four or five days out, it's expected to fully dissipate. On the other side of the continent, this storm system over between the Bahamas and Cuba is gathering strength, and you can clearly see the clouds spinning around a point around the eastern tip of Cuba. According to the models, this thing should start to really get its act together by tomorrow morning, and then you'll start to see it move towards the west, and then up the west coast of Florida just offshore, as shown on that path there. And regardless of whether this is tropical or not, this thing will be bringing some serious impacts to many locations, many significant locations along Florida's west coast, including the Florida Keys, Tampa, Naples, and it may even cross the Florida Peninsula and impact Jacksonville and go up the east coast. And the water temperatures are fully supportive of tropical development, Approaching 90 in some cases along the west coast of Florida. So it will certainly be interesting to see how this thing develops, if it develops, and where it decides to go. So we will be keeping an eye on that for the rest of the week here on Red Weatherman. And a warm welcome to all my new subscribers. For those of you who haven't already, I encourage you to go ahead and hit that subscribe button and ring that notification bell. So you can know if I every time I post a new video and that way you don't miss out on any of the very informative content that gets posted on here on a regular basis.